Yes, the internet comes live on your television every social Friday, and that is courtesy of our TikTokers uh, of the day, Ivy and Flora. Thank you very much for such amazing content and starting our Friday on a high laughing note. Santeni? Thanks for having us. <laughs> Not thanks. Uh, to Jamaliza, but no. oh, I'm just saying thank you for the good content. <laughs> All right. Uh, so, yeah, I'd like to know uh, that a lot goes into that, yeah? Yeah. Yes. For you to have the beard, that's a filter? Yes, it is. That's a filter? Yeah. All right. What, what is the, 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 the highest number of, or the longest mile you've gone uh, to, to make it work, to make a video work for you? What are some of the crazy things you've done uh, to make a video work? The craziest? I think um, there's a video that was shot by my mother. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, mom is mom knows. Yes. All right. Yes, and uh, I had to borrow a chicken, uh -huh. a live chicken, uh -huh. from <laughs> a friend of mine, uh -huh. and yeah, we had to reshoot it like thrice because my little brother came, kept coming into the scene. Uh -huh. So I'm like, cut, 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 director, director. actor, producer. Like, yeah, man, uh -huh. uh -huh. So yeah, that's it. And then uh, the chicken. So we. Put it back into the house in a box. Ikadaribu uh kutoroka. -huh. Uh, it was uh -huh. that's that's yeah the most horrible <laughs> video I've ever made. <laughs> All for a video. Yeah. All that for a video. What about you? What is some of the the craziest things you've done to make a video work for you? Um, I actually don't remember, <laughs> uh -huh. but I think all my videos I go extra mile. You need to go an extra mile yeah. to make it work. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Uh, Oh wait, wait! The uh -huh. one for M-Pesa. Yes. Yes. That was I a lot of makeup, to, yeah. I had to. I, I kept on asking uh, my boyfriend if uh, my my makeup still looked like an M-Pesa lady. I don't know if they look like that. Uh -huh. But then no, I had Why to. Why did people get this idea? I of don't know. It was a trend by yeah, uh, yeah. George Kagwe. Yeah. So mm -hmm. then now I had to make it look like that. So right. you try. I try. I, I change the lipstick. I put it, you know, over over my lips uh -huh. and and all that. And so <laughs> not only hard. is putting on your makeup right hard, putting it on wrong is also hard. We can make up the bad Like like that's, that's the wrong way. Uh -huh. Like yes. supposedly. Yeah. Because uh -huh. that was a challenge, so uh -huh. it had to come. It had like, to be to be right but wrong at the same time. Yes. So you never win with makeup. It's <laughs> hard either way. Huh? Yes, yes, it is. <laughs> All right. How many times do you have to rehearse sometimes to make a video? Um, normally, I I don't like rehearse. I just uh, find an a, a, an audio, mm -hmm. and then I just memorize the words, my parts, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. then just get my costume on and then shoot. That's it. Then right. edit it, post it. That's it. Do you like to rehearse before you hit the stage? Uh, stage in this context. <laughs> in that, in, in in that context. In front of my phone. In that yeah, context, um, yeah. Not really rehearse, but then mm -hmm. um, if, for example, I'm doing uh, teacher Wanjiku mm -hmm. and I have to now learn what she's saying, because you have to be so articulate in whatever you're doing. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, like you have, if you're lip syncing with TikTok, you have to be good at lip syncing. Mm -hmm. Like you have to get exactly what, it has to match with what you're saying. Mm -hmm. Your lips, the movement of your lips have to go exactly with what you yeah. like it's True. the track is so right. now you have to get it right so now you have to memorize literally yes or you'll forget it after sometimes but then sometimes when you actually watch yourself again the videos you live and say it yeah. as right. you're watching yeah. yourself because uh, now it gets i think it depends with the length of the video uh -huh. length or the audio oh, yeah. you're working with like okay, for me i, I tend how short it is uh TikTok is normally 15 seconds the videos right? yeah yeah for me if i'm doing uh, an uh, a video of one minute mm -hmm. i do 15 seconds until that one minute is over mm -hmm. and then mm -hmm. i go edit it okay. and post it on instagram where so is the I editing done on your phone still yes phone on the app or you have to leave the app now and go edit? No, I, I i do them on the app uh -huh. and then i go and Compile on another, on another different yes. app. Yes. So your phone is an application center. Oh, yes, it is. <laughs> All right. I like, I like, I like, I like. Wonderful. All right. So, uh, like I asked the other guys, social media moguls that you idolize. Oh, God. Like guys who have made it on social media that you look at and say, All right, I'd like to 
do it like this um, guy for me mm-hmm. uh she's not directly in line with what i'm doing mm-hmm. but uh betty chalo really inspires me i think mm-hmm. she's really amazing mm-hmm. plus she's my fan so yeah <laughs> <All right. laughs> I feel that Betty Chalo is that one. Another one from outside Kenya. I'd have to say Taraji P Henson. Taraji P, I'm a big fan. I think she is just phenomenal. She's fierce. She, she just every role that embodies her uh-huh. role perfectly. She she's amazing. Uh-huh. Yeah. Taraji P and Betty Chalo. Oh boy, Chal. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> uh, myself in the future yourself in the future yes that's a good one that's yes. powerful <laughs> that's i wish one. i thought of that I'm going <laughs> but to then steal yes that. there are uh people we look up to like uh in kenya wabosha maxine she's she's she doesn't do tiktok mm-hmm. but then she's a young girl like a tiny girl mm-hmm. but she's doing well in the youtube and you know social media industry and she's doing well and there are a couple of kenyan youtubers mm-hmm. they're doing so well in the line of uh digital marketing and all that mm-hmm. so yeah wonderful yeah all right so uh am i right to say just correct me if i'm wrong correct me if i'm wrong please am i right to say you guys have personalities different personalities in one body oh yes yes i'd say no <laughs> you say no no all right so this is the same person that i was seeing on tv that is here with me right now right here yeah just put my phone in front of me my camera and yeah it's the All same right. person what about you <laughs> uh not different personalities in that diverse way but mm-hmm. then cuz i see what not I, in the medical way <laughs> <laughs> i've been told I've, i've heard that before from from some a friend they're like i think you have multiple personalities because of your video i'm like no yeah uh-huh. no You I'm say no. You deny, 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 deny. <laughs> no, no, no. All right. My question is not intended to mean it in the medical way, but just like, all right. Yeah. Because I'm trying to assume sometimes you meet people and they expect you to be that person that they see on TikTok or see on social media. Yeah. yeah. Which is very hard to to be all the time, every single time. Sure. Do you get that? Uh. People expecting you to get there and just be funny. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Funny, I don't know, <laughs> but <laughs> I haven't gotten to the point where you walk on the road and everyone is like, "Ah, not yet." Mm-hmm. So I don't know that. But then there's that different personalities when you're acting a certain uh clip or skit. Mm-hmm. So you have to bring out a different you mm-hmm. which you will not normally put on or wear somewhere else when you're outside with people or you know. All right. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. That was very good insight. So if you have your Oscar speech written somewhere, this is that time. Uh, send okay. shout outs to <laughs> to the people who have made it possible for you to get this far as we wrap this up. Yes, uh, mm-hmm. first. <laughs> okay, uh, I'd like to give a shout out to all my fans. Mm-hmm. Everyone who follows me. My mother, I love you so much. Mm-hmm. My brother Ricky Dynamo, you are the real MVP. Wow. And I want to say thank you to me mm-hmm. for doing this. <laughs> for going this. And I'm great. All right. <laughs> All right. Um, I would say thank you to my fans, um my mother, my family, everyone, and uh, my phone mm-hmm. has suffered. My phone <laughs> has been there. Yes, good one. Yeah. <laughs> yes, really good one. My phone oh, yeah. has been there for me oh. and then myself for pushing myself. All right. Yeah. I appreciate you guys so much one last time. Share with them your social media handles so they can interact with you and get more of those videos that we just saw on TV. Uh mine is my handle is flora_alia mm-hmm. on Instagram and on TikTok. Mm-hmm. Yes. So guys, you can follow me on Instagram Ivy Hadiza official on TikTok also at Ivy Hadiza official. Go download the TikTok app. You're going to love yes. it. All right. It's a beautiful experience. Thank you very much guys for coming. I appreciate it so much. I appreciate the information. I appreciate the good content that you brought to our television. Thank you. Thanks for having us. All right. Yeah, so it's about that time and as I always say, we are off TikTok now. We are uh, we are Y254 is not on TikTok yet. So on the rest of our social media handles, you can interact with us right there. We have a special place in our hearts for the people who send their feedback our way. So keep them coming. We are going to be sampling them in the next segment. But until then, VDJ Khalifa, take it away.
Oh, 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 oh,